what's going on everybody jake the happy snake here and welcome to the 300th episode of jake wants to be a millionaire this is truly remarkable i cannot believe this series has made it to episode number 300 i have enjoyed almost every single episode of this series and when i say almost every episode i mean episodes like episode 23 for example no i'm just joking i have enjoyed every episode of this series it's been so much fun and I just, I, I can't believe that we have made it to the 300th episode. That's just amazing. And out of 299 episodes, I have won a grand total of $17,808,364. So yeah, it's just been great. And today's episode is going to be just as awesome. I am very, very excited for today's episode. Because not only is this episode number 300, but this is also my mom's 76th birthday. 76? Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, you'll, you'll get there in a few years. 34. Um, no, this isn't, uh, this isn't 1942, just so <laughs> uh, Anyways, no, my, my mom's here. Say hi. Hi. Hi, everybody. Because today is actually her birthday. It's kind of amazing how episode 300 uh, f falls exactly on your birthday. Oh, my but, 34th birthday. Oh, my cool. goodness. Um... Anyways, so uh, the money values of today's game are going to be slightly different than normal because every 75 episodes, I have a d special double money episode. And the last time I had one of those was episode 225. So this is the 75th episode. And so this is what the money tree looks like for today. So everything's doubled. So oh, cool. $200 and 400 and 600 and, and then the two guaranteed levels are $2,000 and $64,000. And the top prize is $2 million. Oh. And you might notice that we have a fifth lifeline. We, so we have the five lifelines. We have 50-50, um, phone to friend, ask the audience, switch the question, and plus one. And our plus one is the crazy guy that mom calls her husband, which is my dad. <laughs> so he's going to help us on one question if we need his help. So we're going to try to win $2 million. That would be a very good for, uh, that'd be a very good birthday gift for you. Okay, so let's do this. I am ready to go. Choose easy, and uh, we're gonna choose our character. I think I know who we're gonna pick. So let me just scroll right on through here. Let's pick her because she looks just like you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. Oh, you're such a funny child you are. <laughs> <laughs> she likes she likes mini golf. <laughs> Okay, so let's do this. So remember, everything's um, everything's double. Okay, so we'll have to keep that in mind. <laughs> this is the first time I've played this. Here. What's her name? Margaret. I think her name's Margaret. Not Margaret. Margaret. Okay. Let's take a look at the first question for two hundred dollars rather than one hundred. Which of these tools is not used for gardening? A shovel, a pickaxe, a rake, or an oven? I believe it's a shovel. No, I'm kidding. No, I think <laughs> that would it'd be, be my guess. Seriously? No. <laughs> <laughs> I thought she was serious for a second. No, it's an oven. Hey, we're doing well. Ooh, it's plain, 200. As, plain as the old lady. <laughs> okay, 200. All right. Next question is for 400. It's doubled from the normal 200. Okay. What is the name of the biggest basketball league in the world? The NBA, the, the NBB, the NBC, the NBD. The NBA. All right. right. Woohoo! So four hundred dollars. So that would be three ninety-five for me and five dollars for you. Happy birthday! <laughs> Thank you. You're all heart. Thank you. I'm also all brains. Okay. Next question for six hundred. What colors do you have to mix to get purple? Pink and blue. Blue and red, which is the right answer. Yellow and green, and pink and red. That would be blue and red, correct? Yes. I wonder what pink and red would make. Huh. Uh, that's six hundred dollars. Next question is for one thousand, but it's not guaranteed. Ooh. Um, just because it's doubled. Okay. Uh, which needles sting when you touch them? Uh, green needles, red needles, white needles, brown needles. You know this? I'm pretty sure it's green. Yeah, so let's do that. So we'll go with green. This green is my favorite color. Woo there we go. That's one thousand dollars. That is not guaranteed, though. That's doubled from the normal five hundred. And now we go for two thousand. This is guaranteed, so it's good to get this one right. In what year did the people of the United Kingdom vote in referendum to leave the European Union? 1986, 1996, 2006, 2016. Read the question again. 
In what year did the people of the United Kingdom vote in referendum to leave the European Union? I would say 2016. Alright. I'll trust your gut. I'm not sure. D, final answer. Yes! Alright, thank you. I wasn't sure about that. So that's 2,000 bucks, that's guaranteed. Alright. So we're 10 questions away from 2 million. We still have all five lifelines, so we're in good shape. The next question is for 4,000. Double from the normal 2,000. Which animal neighs? A dog, a weasel, an otter, or a horse? A horse. A horse. Dad's, <laughs> Dad's favorite animal. Dad, we, should, we should use the plus one, even though we know the answer. All right, it's a horse. D, final answer. All right. All right. 4,000 bucks. Doing well. Doing very well. Six for six. Next question is for 8,000. What is the name of the kingdom in Frozen? I should call up Tyler. I think Tyler's seen that movie. <laughs> um, I think I've had this before. And I think it's... I think it's D. But I'm not 100% sure. What is that. it? I have. I don't. I don't know this one at all. You, you've never seen Frozen? No. <laughs> it's, a, it's a Disney movie. I know. Um, 50-50? Okay. I think it's D. Or we could just we just risk it. No, let's use 50-50. All right. If you're not sure. I'm. It's nice to have five lifelines, but I don't know. It's nice to also play it safe, I guess. Let's see where it leaves. All right, leave. All right, let's go with let's go with oh, D. Oh yeah, okay, yes, D. If it if it had taken that one away, that that would be really bad. <laughs> D, final answer. All right. Woo Sweet. So that's eight thousand bucks. All right. Seven for seven. Next up is question number eight for sixteen thousand. In what year did the euro become the official currency of Europe? Oh, I have no idea. Do you know? I would have said early 2000s, but that's yeah. kind of that, that's kind of evident. Uh, um, lifeline? I guess so. I don't think Dad would Dad know this. Probably not. Well, right. he might. He's good with dates, but what other ones do we have? So we have phone a friend, ask the audience, switch the question, and plus one. Switch the question or audience? Sure. Audience? What do you want? What do you think? I would switch the question because okay, chances are if we switch the question, like the other day, I switched the question on a two hundred fifty thousand dollars question. It was about shepherd's pie. I had the right answer, and they switched it to to history of writing. I'm not gonna know a question about history of okay. writing, so it didn't help me at all. So I feel like it's better to switch the question earlier on. Okay. So we'll switch the question. Yeah. All right. Let's see what the correct answer was. I would have said um, I don't know. What, I would have said B, two thousand one. Oh. Two thousand two. Alright. I was wondering off. I was four years old my year. <laughs> Alright. Let's take a look at the new sixteen thousand dollar question. What dynasty did John F. belong? <laughs> Vanderbilt's Kennedy's The Kennedys. How, how, how certain are you? Certain. Alright. One thing I learned. Uh, living in this family, never question, never question Linda. <laughs> B final answer. Thank you, Mom. All right, that's sixteen thousand. Next up is question number nine for thirty-two thousand, but it's not guaranteed because everything is doubled. So we still have, uh, we still have three lifelines. So okay. phone a friend, ask the audience, and plus, plus one. one. Okay. What is the biggest snake in the world? <sighs> Jake the snake. <laughs> Uh, this is one that I think maybe Dad might yes, know. I would agree. Do you want to call the Dad? Plus one, yes. plus one? Okay, yes. we're going to use the plus one and ask Dad. Hopefully he knows this. Okay, so Dad's here. Dad, say hi to the audience. Hi, audience. Uh, Dad's our plus one. What is the biggest snake in the world? The boa? The biggest snake in the world. No, not the boa. The Grand Anaconda, then. 
It could be either the anaconda or the python. I think it might be the anaconda. Oh, that's not good enough. You, have, you have to be 100% sure. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I just is this a... Uh, what lifelines do we have left? Is this it? Um, no, there's a phone a friend and uh, ask the audience. So she's used the 50-50? Yeah. I think it's and the, the switch. And I, the switch. I think it might be the anaconda. I think it's bigger than the python. I know anaconda is like, they can be like 30 feet long. So let's go with that. I'm about 75% sure. All right, do you want to go with that then? Sure. You better be right, Dad. If I'm not, if you're I'm not, getting any supper tonight. Oh, oh the python. <laughs> oh, well. I'm sorry. No, you're not. You're a leaf fan. I'm just kidding. No, that's okay. That's, yeah. So what did we get? 30? Uh, we get, um, it's normal. it normally would be a thousand, but we get two thousand. Right? Oh, because everything, okay. everything's double. That's good. What do they mean by, like, Anaconda's the longest, <laughs> the python might be the widest. It's too late now. You already gave us the wrong answer. That was my second choice. <laughs> well, that's not good enough. enough. I'm sorry. I'm just joking. Oh, no, Dad, thank you very much. Thanks, Artie. Yeah, thank you. You never know I have a degree in biology. <laughs> well, thank you, Mom. For joining us. My pleasure. And Thank you for ha having me. Happy birthday. Thank you very much. Uh, happy, what was it? 70, I said 76. 34. No. 34. Um, all right. Well, thanks, Mom. Okay. Thank you very much. Well, that was definitely disappointing to say the least, but whatever, it is what it is. $2,000 is better than nothing. That brings my overall total to $17,810,364. So guys, that is it for the 300th episode of this series. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. I had a lot of fun, although I would have definitely preferred to have won more money than two grand, but who cares? So yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you all have a great weekend, and I will see you back here on Monday. Peace out.